What's going on, everybody? This is Lenny, a.k.a. All In. And today, I wanted to talk about um, FlexCar. Um, and, you know, FlexCar is in Atlanta now. And, you know, probably like three, three weeks ago, probably three or four weeks ago, I had a little ticking coming out of my Jeep. And I'll probably applaud a video so you can hear it. Anyway, I decided, you know, try to figure out where to go and take the vehicle. And by that time, you know, I only had one vehicle because I had, uh, and I had another vehicle before that and it was, um, total. So I just had the Jeep at the time and, um, let's step out here. It was a little bit windy. So let's see if it's a little, oh yeah, it's still windy. So anyway, I decided I came across Flex Car and I decided to give it a try. Um, I was going to rent a car probably for, you know, probably a week or two. And you talk about a rental car is basically what, $40, $50 a day. So I came across just doing my Googles. I came across this company that's called uh, Flex Car. And you basically get a car from $80 lower $60 um, a week but the drawback is mileage and they got two um, mileage bases which is 49 cents per mile and if you become a member which is $199 per year $199 per year you can get the 39 cents per mile which is 10 cents less and 10 cents less adds up if you think about it so um Hope it ain't too windy for y'all out here, but you see the trees going crazy. Um, so to date, I bet I am on my third flex car. You can switch, you can do all of that fly stuff. You can do, you know, you can switch and get different models that ranges from um, Kias all the way up to Land Rovers. So this is what I have now. This is a Kia Sportage. It's a 2021. Which is cool. Something to get around with. And like I said, you don't really want to get it if you're going long distances or you're traveling far in different directions or just every day because it's not. It's, it's, I go to work and back. So basically, this is cool. My job is probably 20 miles away. Probably less than that. So as my truck. My Jeep is getting fixed, getting all the rockers and lifters and all that other fly stuff on the inside of the engine fixed. I got this. Now, like I said, this is my third vehicle. Now, one thing I would say you want to do when you get a flex car, you want to take a picture of any scratches or dings or any kind of stuff going on in the inside so you won't get charged with it. Because you have to put a down payment of, it's refundable, think anywhere from 250 to 350 and you get that back at the end of your you know your usage like i said you can swap you can do everything with it and is it for you you have to decide that yourself you have to decide do i want to you know 60 dollars a week because i am a member and i paid the 199 for the whole year because even when i get my jeep back i'm gonna still just grab me a flex car to take the miles off my Jeep, you know, so I don't have to rock my Jeep every day. So I might still have me a flex car. And like I said, you can keep it as long as you want. You just have to be aware of the mileage. All right. And living in Atlanta, everything is far. So the mileage will rack up on you. So um, is it a company for you? That's something you just have to figure out. I know one thing you could go. Like I said, you could get a regular rental car, which is about 30 to 50 a day, or you can get something like this, which is about 60 to 80 a week and just budget your mileage. But like I said, to you, you will probably know, you'll probably calculate, you know, the areas you're going to go and, and, you know, because you on their insurance, all you have to do is pay the mileage and the weekly pay and replace the gas whatever the gas is when you pick it up like i said you always want to document 
any scratches, dings, because they would take away from that down payment if you don't record any dings or scratches, or even if the interior is real dirty, they'll charge you a clean fee. So overall, I'm cool with this company. I'm cool with, um, you know, not really putting miles on your car and dipping it back and forth in different cars. Like I said, I won't go all the way up to the Land Rover. I like the little compact blend in get around which sometimes i don't like the rough ride of my team so i want to switch it out um it beats buying a whole nother car raising your insurance and so just try that for yourself i think it's good for what i'm doing it might not be good for you so like i said the cars come clean all marauded up and shining and and, and just check it out flexcar.com and like I said, it's in the Atlanta area now. It's in a couple other cities. And um, that's just my review of it. It all boils down to the person and what they what they expect to do with it. All right? All right, everybody. Peace.